Believe it or not, at the second day of Sea Island Adventure, we're almost in our journey here. He's calling you down, he's calling you down. We had so much fun in our first day of Sea Island Adventure. We check out two very famous tourist spots and make sure you go back to watch the last video. So while I was editing my first video of Xi'an, I received some comments about well, a few things I can improve to the video. This is my friend Luisa, she's from Germany and currently a student in China. I invited her to go on this trip to Xi'an and she also has her own YouTube channel and Instagram channel. Feel free to check it out. Now let's begin with our day 2 in Xi'an. Good morning everybody, welcome to day 2 in Xi'an. So right now I'm in one of the morning markets. So you're wondering what morning market exactly looks like. It's like where the local shop of groceries and some pre-cooked food for the family. It's a Sunday morning. That's why it's like extra crowded. This morning market is located in one of the city wall corner. So two things about morning market. One is fresh. You got an old tofu, you got a new tofu, you got a fried tofu, you got a dope here, fish tofu. Second one is the price. 10 yuan for eight. They're really cheap. Be amazed by the real local Chinese. The price, the cost of living. I finally got something. Wow. Family business. Menu, you are. Please, here, which food is the best? Oh, you are, menu. Can you see what this is? I am filming a vlog. Oh, okay. Thank you. Bula Tang Jia Ma Hua? We are not Chinese. Oh, okay. Thank you. Oh, you, you, this is tofu tofu. I don't know. Tofu tofu. Oh, thank you. Okay, I know. 他们说水煎包好吃啊！我问了对面的阿姨。啊、oh. ，谢谢你们。I will give this 东昌门早市 ，I will give it ten out of ten. So in the afternoon, I decided to check out some local activities. I really hope that they are not eating the cats and dogs. Just kidding. Xi'an people don't eat them. No? Maeva? Familia. Dongtian. Winter. 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 Luisa found her favorite cup. This one is That's a nice one. Uh, uh, this is uh, no China. This is a Japan. Japan. Yeah, Japan. Oh, mm -hmm. Japanese cup. What do you buy in China? Pottery. Pottery, of course. <laughs> Two hundred. Yeah. Is it, today is twenty yuan. Two hundred. Two hundred. But today is twenty. But tomorrow is ten. <laughs> she will ask for, ask for ten. Who? That's a Buddhist. Yeah. Twenty yuan. What did you just get? Pottery, teapots. And uh, we spent like 115 yuan. How much would you say like uh, you would spend that in, in Germany? I think 400. 400 euros or 400 yuan? yuan I think. Next we're going to Da Tang, Da Tang Night Market. Da Tang Night Market is like the most alike with the Tang Dynasty, mm -hmm. the nightlife in Tang Dynasty. You will see a lot of like Chinese women dressing in Chinese style, ancient style, and then they will be dancing. Okay. Yeah, That's a lot of like uh, traditional music instruments, a lot of elements, Tang Dynasty. So, okay, ready for our rest of the day adventure. After the flea market, it was our first time went out of the city wall area, which made us see a different style of Xi'an. It's like the skyscrapers combined with historical building, how cyberpunk. We had some Chinese barbecue, but Luisa didn't enjoy them. <laughs> Then we took a bike to the beautiful must-visit Grand Tang Wall. 
known as Dao Tang Buye Chen, which directly translates Tang Dynasty Life, you never gonna sleep. Oh, no one knows where we're going. So how's your journey so far, like uh, in, in Xi'an? Great. I'm very, I'm very happy. I, I have the opportunity now to see more of the country because I was in Zhuhai all the time, um, and Xi'an is, is different. So you can see so many things. I think the weather is better, um, and also the things we're doing here. It's very interesting. Also with the, with the uh, history, the Tang Dynasty. Mm. Uh, it's, it's, they are very, all the women are wearing those beautiful dresses and. I think the, the buildings and architecture is, is very nice here. Very, mm. very different from Zhuhai. God, you mentioned the architecture because yeah. in Zhuhai, Zhuhai is like a new town. Yes. And, and like Zhuhai is like Guangdong Delta area is like everything is built up from farmland. So you don't see a lot of historical buildings around. And also nobody's dressed in a special way. Mm. So what do you give Xi'an uh, out of 10? What do you give? I think I'd give it a 9 out of 10. I 9 don't, out of 10? Yeah, I don't yeah. know if there's anything better so I'll just give it a 9 out of 10. Mm. So because I, I just came from Beijing, uh, I was there like almost two weeks, I give Xi'an like 7, 8 mm -hmm. out of 10 um, because one is because uh, Xi'an is like a little bit small, I think it's like a small, small. very small. <laughs> For me it's big. <laughs> mm. Um, Beijing, I like Beijing, Beijing is like big style but if you're looking for like a, a quiet vibe of similar with Beijing, Xi'an is a good place to go. Yeah, and I think also if you're interested in uh, Chinese culture and history, history mm. this, is, this is what you imagine when you think about ancient China. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You can see a lot of... All these like these war, things, yeah. city walls, yes. all this architecture, just beautiful. Mm -hmm. For the first museum, the first tour. Georgia, we are we are in Macon, Georgia. Macon, Georgia? Georgia's, yeah. every face is different. It's beautiful.